It's the weekend, y'all. Don't let it go to waste. Hey you guys, just getting my 30 minute run in today. This is uh, week two of my uh, shooting training program and I've been doing cardio six days a week. And so it's Saturday and so I'm getting after it again, getting some more cardio going and it feels good. Every day feels a little bit better. Some days are better than others and some days are harder to wake up than others and get my run done. It's slowly getting better, getting a little bit easier and my cardio and stuff is getting a lot easier and shooting my bow is starting to get a little bit better too. Even after kind of a, uh, a hard week, a little bit of a struggling sort of week, having some back pain and stuff like that. In spite of all that, things seem to be getting better. My shooting's getting a little bit tighter and uh, I'm seeing better results. So now all we gotta do is just get back home. I went on a little bit of a, a walk around the neighborhood right now just to get a little cool down going before I head back inside. And we're gonna hit the garage and, uh, and then get some hit training going. So. It's going to be a little bit of a, uh, a cardio sort of endurance double whammy. So let's get after it. Out here at Bow Hunters Unlimited, Sunday morning, and uh, just out here getting some long, some long range stuff going, doing some long range work. This is uh, one of my groups at 50 yards. This is the, one of the 50 yard bales. Not doing too bad, looking pretty good. Looking like I could tighten it up just a little bit for sure. But yeah, having a great time shooting with uh, people I haven't seen that much these days. It's a nice, bright, <laughs> warm day if you can't tell. So I'll probably get a few more arrows in and then call it a day. It's getting pretty warm out here and the black flies are coming out and trying to get in my eyes, <laughs> which sort of sucks. Uh, but then uh, probably put in another training session later today and uh, do a little more work in the backyard dojo. So yeah, we'll see you there. We're outside in the backyard dojo and uh, obviously it's a little bit later in the day and I got home a little while ago and kind of waited for it to cool down a little bit and for the sun to get a little bit lower. It was getting pretty hot outside 
And so uh, we're in the backyard dojo right now and I'm going to be doing a little bit of work to kind of focus on some of those inconsistencies I was having out on the range at Bowhunters Unlimited. And to do that, we're gonna be doing some blind bail work. And so I'm gonna be drawing back to anchor, loading everything up, getting on target, and then I'm gonna be closing my eyes and then focusing on a nice smooth release and focusing on the feel of the shot. This is something I like to do before most of my trainings that I get into. So I'll normally start out my trainings to kind of warm up with about 20 or 30 blind bail shots. And then from there, uh, I've got a good sense of what a good shot feels like. And then I can go into my actual training, whether it's uh, focusing on doing a 300 round. It's a really great way to start out your training session. I recommend it. Let's get into it. y'all that's it for the video today i hope you guys had as much fun watching this little video of mine as i did making it and uh, i had a great time this weekend getting outside getting to do some cardio and some physical fitness training as well as being able to go out to bow hunters unlimited and do some long range work as well and that's my hope is that you guys are also able to get outside and uh, sling some arrows and work hard towards your goals uh, i'm working hard towards my goals and i hope you guys will follow along in this little youtube experiment of mine so I continue to make more videos like this in the future, as well as some gear reviews and how-to videos. So remember guys, get outside, get to the range, and keep training y'all. Let's get after it. Yeah.